World War II, a period of history that starkly defines good and evil. Even today, Germany's laws reflect its stance on the Holocaust and Nazi occupation. This sets the stage for our intriguing story from a wealthy suburb in northern Germany. In the affluent suburb of Kiel, an elderly man's basement held a secret. Rumoured to possess illegal Nazi memorabilia, this man's home became the focal point of a fascinating discovery. Post-World War I, Germany's economic and social unrest fueled the rise of Adolf Hitler. The Treaty of Versailles, which imposed heavy sanctions on Germany, played a key role in this upheaval. Beyond the horrifying genocide, the Nazis were infamous for their theft and destruction of personal property. Even today, we continue to discover and understand the extent of their crimes. The widespread Nazi party had factions fascinated by the occult, some even theorizing that occultism birthed the Nazi party. Their interest in historically significant items was profound. Post-World War II, Germany enacted laws banning symbols of unconstitutional organizations, including Nazi symbols and memorabilia. These laws are pivotal to our story. Further laws banned Hitler's manifesto, Mein Kampf, and any Nazi memorabilia. The possession of such items is strictly regulated and often leads to state scrutiny. In pursuit of stolen Nazi artwork, Berlin police investigated a wealthy man's home. Instead of art, they stumbled upon a trove of hidden artifacts from the World War II era. Although the initial search was fruitless, the police couldn't ignore what they had seen. This led to a second raid, this time focusing on the hidden artifacts. Upon entering the home, the police discovered an astonishing sight, a collection of World War II era weapons, including a full-size tank. Germany's strict gun laws extend to weapons of war, making the elderly man's collection not just surprising, but also illegal. The discovery of the tank baffled everyone. The local military was called in to assess the situation and determine the next steps. The tank, weighing a massive 45 tons, posed a significant challenge. How were they going to remove this World War II relic from the property? Beyond the military weapons, the man's collection included Nazi memorabilia, a bust of Hitler, SS rune-shaped lamps, and even a statue from Hitler's chancellery in Berlin. Despite the damning evidence, the man's lawyer insisted his client had done nothing wrong, stating that all the weapons had been demilitarized and were legal to own. However, in 2021, the German court found the man guilty of illegal weapons possession, fining him 250,000 euros and sentencing him to a suspended prison term of 14 months. This case serves as a stark reminder of Germany's commitment to acknowledging and learning from its past. As we delve into history, we must remember the importance of preventing its darkest chapters from recurring. If you like this video, consider subscribing to our YouTube channel and learn more about how we enhance history.